Hey everyone, King Seeker here. Welcome to King Seeker's first build. I made a fireplace. Hopefully my chair doesn't catch on fire. everyone, King CK's first build. Welcome to my second build I've ever done. Um, probably not the second episode though, and I'm going to put some fire in the fire making area. I hope I don't burn my house down because I'd be pissed off because it's the only save I have of this world. Um, this is actually one of my old, old, old um, builds, and this is actually just a house I built legitly in survival. Hey, the fire actually burnt out alright. Good. Um, did what it was supposed to, and that chick chicken just crapped an egg across ice. Why I have a lot of areas in ice biomes, I don't know. This wasn't in an ice biome when I originally played it. Oh, oh well. Uh, right here I got the bridge down to the main attraction over here, which is the train station. I did this all legit too, might I mind you, and this is actually the original purpose of this level was this was built back like when I first started Minecraft, before beds, before it all, back when it only had like five saves. Um, We'll ride down this horribly glitchy minecart system. Um, but yeah, so this was made long, 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 long ago. And it was Survival Island, which if any of you guys remember this game, which it's still, I think it's still around. I'm not 100% positive on that, though. And this used the old uh, minecart booster system where it would catch the cart and then go flying at a bajillion miles an hour. And over here we just got the basic train station, which would go around to all my different mining outposts. But the more important one, which I think it should be over here somewhere. Gotta remember where exactly everything is, because I haven't actually played on this level in quite some time. Um, I think it's up over here, yeah. There used to be a tree right here that grew up, um, and that's what led to me having to encase that lava a little bit better. I had that lava encased originally, but somehow this tree grew up, it caught fire, burned down the whole station. I come down from being up in my house overnight, only to find out my thing had burned down. So I was kind of bummed out about that. But down here is, this is where I made my uh, my underground house, I should say. This is the second house I ever did under here. Um, not second, second house I never, or not second house I ever built, but second house I ever did on this thing. So I'll light the fire down here. I had a lot of fires that I just run the old-fashioned way, because this is before I actually even knew about the nether, and I think it was actually almost before, no, it wasn't before the nether, but it was right around the same time nether was imp implemented. And why my Minecraft is lagging like a bitch still, I do not know. So one second while I fix that. There we go. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, my render distance was a little bit high, and for some reason Minecraft has been lagging like a bitch lately, but I'll have to figure that out a little bit better. Um... But yeah, so this is pretty much it for it. I built just this big area of minecarts going everywhere. Keep in mind, all done legit once again. And it's little... This was the original little place that came with the place if you mined down and found that area. I'll check and see if this minecart system still works. These were before boost rails. Long, long, long before boost... God damn it. Long before boost rails. And apparently it doesn't quite work. I think I kept booster carts lying throughout this thing, so doesn't work that's probably why but I can remember where all the stations are I think there's two stations on the track and this is the last thing I did before I quit this mine or this uh, survival island thing actually hang on I don't know what's inside this box because this was back when you could open them without having the top area yeah, looks like it's empty um, yeah this is one of the this is the fireside station um, used to have a giant giant oversized lava like pool right here so I named it fireside station made a little cute station thing had the our, uh, booster system right there and we'll continue along the track here which I think goes this way yep here we go I should know my builds a little bit better oh and then it bring you back so it, it only had two stations oh crap I fell um, only had two stations first one fireside I was probably going to do a lot more. I had that other one planned, and I did, 
I actually did do this lo or different map save of it, or that, or I never forgot it to save. Because I had it so I could switch between this track right here and the ones that were in there, and I had a big expansion onto this uh, train station, but there really wasn't anything much detail-wise. It was just bigger train station. But that pretty much wraps it up. Uh, for those of you wondering, I am using ELD pack. I'll pack uh, from uh, 1. Point, I think it's 1.4, possibly beta-wise. I mean, not Minecraft-wise. It's 1.4 beta. Um, and this is the original texture pack I actually played with at that time, and I love this texture pack still to this day. I did an update for it, and then Planet Minecraft, those assholes, took it off there. That's why I'm, one of the reasons I fucking hate Planet Minecraft staff, but that's a whole other story. Any, but that's, that's a whole other can of worms I'll, I'll get into. But yeah, that's pretty much about it. Um, anyone willing to update this texture pack so it looks similar, I you guys would be fucking awesome and I you should don't totally go paste it over on Minecraft forums and send me a link if you ever update this texture pack because this texture pack's been left in the beta uh, because, partially because the person who made it fell off the face of the internet so but yeah on that guys I'd like to thank you guys for watching make sure you guys leave a like comment rate subscribe and if you guys have one of your old builds you thought really cool or just something that you remember working on and want to explain it and show it off leave a video response. I know I'll be more than happy to watch it. So, other than that, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.